Here is a video that is kind of a challenge and hopefully it will help some of you. In the United States we can get lumber in a variety of different sizes, but uh, a little while ago an individual asked if I could build a stairway entirely out of 2x4. And they said that that's the largest piece of lumber they can get in their country. And I didn't ask what country it was in. I do know that uh, someone emailed me from Israel one time and they were having a problem. I think a 2x8 was the largest board they could get. So if you know what country that is, feel free to share it in the comment area. But I'm going to go ahead and get started. And again, entirely out of 2x4. And you can use screws or nails to attach everything together and to give you some measurements here 7 inch risers 10 and a half inch wide treads if you want to leave an eighth of an inch gap between everything then uh, the risers can be a little taller and the treads can be a little wider and what I'm going to do is take the stairway apart and then put it back together so uh, it's just going to be a process I know it's it's uh, a lot of people um, when they're doing how-to videos or how-to books, they just show you from a blank spot, uh, you know, uh, or, you know, uh, uh, maybe just the concrete here, and then they build it. But I think it's better to tear it apart and put it back together. And again, with these videos, it doesn't take long to do. So let's tear this thing apart. So it'll give you an idea of what you're actually going to be building when you put it together. Take the risers out. And then we can pull this down here. So you can see in this video here, I'm actually going to do this a little different. You know, I'm building the sides up in this one. But when I put it back together, I'm going to be doing one step at a time. So you can do it this way here if you just reverse the process. Or you can do it this way. So we're going to start with our bottom board here and then put in our braces and then we're going to put our riser in and then our tread so we're just going to kind of work our way up in the other one if you remember we didn't put our risers and treads on we built the side of the stairway first but uh, this way right here might be a little easier risers and another view of it there go ahead and put a couple of more support boards in and these braces here are critical they're going to hold this together and you might actually need to put a couple of them over here if you think it's going to be uh, weak um, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put another brace in and that can always be done after the stairway um, is built but uh, you know while you're building it and you get to a certain point you know, uh, and you're going to be kind. You're not going to be able to get to it from the back. Even like this point here would be good. You know, you could come in here and just put a brace in here, or have it come up a little bit. Uh, let's move it back there. You could have it come from here down. This would kind of be in the middle, so it would start up here and then go down to here, and that would stiffen this up. But as you nail everything together, you're going to see that these boards. And these boards here are going to uh, strengthen everything up. You're going to have a nice um, connection here. You're going to be uh, nailing or screwing into the braces or through the braces here into the um, other side boards here. And I'm going to show you more on the nailing here at the end of the video, give you an idea. And again, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment area. I know that... Uh, when I'm building this stuff and and on the uh, on the computer, I can see okay, this is a problem. Like I, like I'm doing here, you know, I didn't put the riser in here because I need to be able to get this um, top support brace in. I need to be able to attach the brace to these side boards here. So you can see here if I put this board on I could still get to it but I'm not going to be able to get to it if I put the top treads on so you could always put the riser on here as long as you're going to be able to have enough room to uh, access some of these other spots and then simply cap it off and you are done but don't turn the video off yet let's take a look at how we would nail or attach these you can use nails or screws whatever you feel is going to work best 
and simply nail and I don't think one nail is going to be enough for a 2x4. You're probably going to need two nails. Um, center them on the uh, where you're going to be nailing into these boards below it and maybe about an inch or three quarters from the edge. And if it splits, pull the nail out and move it over a little bit. And then of course you can nail down the front of this to connect these two boards together and the risers again two nails and then the brace you can use one nail um, per board or you can use two nails per, per board or use two nails one nail two nails whatever you feel or screws and of course you can always nail to um, nail the back of the riser into this tread to create a stronger step without these nails here um, you might not have a very strong step. And if you're worried about this one here, um, you know, this one's going to be sitting on top of here. And then you're going to be screwing this. You're going to be making this one here a little stronger. But this one here in the middle might not be stronger. You might need to put a board on the bottom of this and uh, um, screw it from the top or screw it uh, from the bottom or even a couple of support braces in there to uh, get a little stronger connection. And uh, again, if you have any questions about that, feel free to leave them in the comment area. That is it for the video. And uh, something like this seems like it would work. If you do build something like this and it's not working, it doesn't, uh, you know, doesn't work out, let us know what you're having a problem with. A lot of times I'll draw something on the computer. And this is something I've never built before um, physically. You know, I just kind of uh, trying to help somebody out in another country who can't get um, larger pieces of wood. You know, um, you might have to uh, work with something like this. And in order to work with something like this, you might have to modify it, you know, in a certain way. And again, I have two kind of braces here, you know, um, and this is a three foot wide stairway. And like I said, if this right here is going to be a little loose, um, you could always put another one of these support um, side um, stringers, let's say, in the middle. And uh, you would use three of these, and that would take the place of three stringers. And then, of course, that would really make it a lot stronger. 